This CD haul is quite small. I got only three CDs. Mostly Billie Eilish. My brother and sister got me hooked on Billie Eilish. I heard a lot about her last year when she released her debut album, When We All Fall Asleep, Where Do We Go? I listened to it and I'm like, what the heck is she all about? You know, I've, I hear her name a lot, you know, but what's there to know about her? And, you know, my brother and sister told me who Billie was and I, once I found out why a lot of people like her, I started listening to her and reading about her and it just, you know, every time I watch a documentary or read about some some celebrity, it just makes me want to listen to them. Like when I listened to Bon Jovi, when I watched a documentary about Bon Jovi, I started listening to more and more Bon Jovi. Now I'm a quite a big fan of Bon Jovi. Well, I quite enjoy Billie Eilish's music, and what I like about her, mostly besides her songwriting and her singing, is the fact that she is very outspoken, not afraid to speak her mind, and she's overall pretty down to earth it looks like and she seems pretty funny like she should start her own comedy special <laughs> that'd be kind of cute and hilarious plus she swept the grammy awards i remember this is it the grammy award winning album when we all fall asleep where do we go and this is her ep demo demo don't smile at me really good introduction to Billie Eilish. This is our introduction. And this is, hey, now you're gonna get more. People are like, this is cool. And yes, Billie is certainly cool. Mainly, I find her an inspiration when it comes to tackling topics like bullying. Recently, she was body shamed after a picture of her was leaked out on the internet. I don't understand why people would bully her. You know, it seemed like she had a lot of people that, devoted fans that love her. And then, all of a sudden, people are starting to bully her. Why? But personally, I've been bullied too, and I don't know why either. So people will just bully you for no particular reason. But if you're going to combat bullying, here's one to listen to. I am sorry, I have to take the... I have to take it out of the package. This is Metallica's 1991 self-titled album, also known as The Black Album. And it has good reason to be called the Black Album. It's just black everything, you know, black title, black logo. All that's on there is this snake. All that's on there is this snake. And if you look closely, look closely on there, guys. If you look really close, right there, you can see the Metallica logo. This is the album that turned Metallica into the household name they are today. Well, I mean, sure, there's Master of Puppets, but this one turned them into the superstars they are today. This album is just as big as Billy's, okay? When this album came out, people were just picking them out of the stores. Record stores were just picked clean from this album. Well, the same goes with Metallica's Black Album. This album catapulted them to superstardom. This is one of the highest selling albums in history. The album just kept on going. It's just, it was just one of those albums up there with Michael Jackson's Thriller and the Eagles' Greatest Hits album. It's just one of those albums that you say, hey, let's get that. After that, Metallica just had hit after hit after hit after hit with their tours and their fans. Just one year after this was released, they went on an epic stadium tour with Guns N' Roses. Well, I mean, sure. Maybe their single Enter Sandman is what helps them pick up this album in the first place, but I think it's also because this album featured most of their other big hits like Said But True, The Unforgiven, Wherever I May Roam, and Nothing Else Matters. When you have an album that just keeps on selling and selling and selling, you just have to keep touring to support the album and your fans. Mostly support your fans that love the album. Both these albums just kept on going and they still continue to go to this day. So, if you are interested in hearing other music, you might want to check these albums out because I guarantee you, you're going to have an experience when it comes to music.